New information tonight on an explosion at a Goodwill store in Austin, Texas. Residents of the state's capital are on edge following a string of explosions. But as Nikki Batiste reports, this was a separate incident. Elizabeth, there was chaos and confusion here near a Goodwill store where a box with a flammable device was dropped off. It was another scare for this community. On Tuesday night, there were reports of an incident at a Goodwill store in the Texas state capitol. Many here feared the serial bomber had struck again, but police and the ATF say it wasn't a bomb. This incident is not related to any of the other incidents that we've had here in Austin. This was a old military type ordinance that initiated in this person's hand and it did cause injury. Earlier, investigators said two suspicious packages found Tuesday are connected to four earlier explosions in Austin. The confirmation came after one of them exploded in a FedEx facility in Schertz, Texas, about 60 miles southwest of Austin. First responders described what they saw. There were nails, nails in the barn. Kind of was going to Austin. One FedEx employee suffered minor injuries, but investigators don't believe the device was supposed to detonate when it did. A package had been traveling along the automated conveyor when it had, had exploded. It was the fifth bombing in the area since March 2nd. Hours later, a second suspicious box turned up at another FedEx location. FedEx said it had been mailed by the same person who sent the one that blew up. Investigators are now examining it for evidence. They're also warning the public to remain vigilant. The bombings have claimed two lives and left four others injured. 350 federal law enforcement agents are now in Austin, assisting local police in their search for the serial bomber. Residents throughout Austin are on high alert. Authorities say they have surveillance video that could possibly show a suspect. In Austin, I'm Nikki Batiste on the Night Beat.